What is going on guys? Shummel Gamer here with another quick Dragon's Dogma 2 video. This one will be for the Phantom Ox Cart quest. I'm pretty sure in order to unlock this quest, you have to progress the main storyline where you get to the point where you get through the main city in the southern part of the map there because this quest will bring you there. So I don't think you can start this quest until you've uh, gotten to that point at least. I found this quest at the West Vernworth Ox Cart Station. I don't know if you can get it at other Ox Cart Stations, but I just overheard a rumor there um, with the Ox Cart driver and then the a quest automatically appeared uh in my inventory for me you do need to do this at nighttime, so obviously just either rest at a checkpoint nearby or find a bench at or rest at the inn and then you will come to the spot marked on the map and you will see the phantom ox cart and you will get a brief uh, cut scene here that i'll cut out afterwards you will chase down the man that was there and you will get an option i do not believe this option matters but i did choose the accept his gold and let him go because i'm a greedy sob the other option is to escort him back and basically i think to jail he will give you a letter that you need to find someone that knows about this letter. This man, of course, will be Captain Brant. The quest doesn't tell you that, but just bring it to Captain Brant, and you can deliver the merchant's document, and then this will progress the quest a little bit farther. He's going to give you an option about what to do with this quest. Now, if you want the achievement or trophy associated with this quest, you need to pretend that you're a pawn and board the Phantom Ox Cart. So wait a full day and go back to where the Ox Cart is, and unequip everything that uh, you're wearing, your armor, your weapons, your rings, everything. So you should look just like a pawn, and then you can talk to the driver, and he thinks you are a pawn, and then you can ride the Phantom Ox Cart to the final location. That is how you get the achievement or trophy. If you choose the other option, I do not believe you can get the achievement because you end up not riding the Phantom Ox Cart. So once you do that, go into the cart, Hit the exam button you will get the achievement there and we have a couple more steps to do to finish the quest the you'll run into um sort of a checkpoint here where you have to defeat the goblins do not equip any armor or weapons or anything just beat these guys up also don't um command your pawns or do anything just literally punch these guys until you're dead you don't want to raise any suspicions that you are more than a pawn after that you can just go back and get into the ox cart and you will progress again through the quest after the goblins, you will get to the second checkpoint here, and you're going to do the same thing. Just don't equip any weapons or armors. This time, you're just going to take a beat in. Don't fight back at all. After the cutscene's over, you will get back into the ox cart, and you will end up at the last destination here. Uh, this time, you are going to be discovered that you are the Arisen, and you can equip your weapons and armor. This is a very hard fight. You're going to fight basically 10 to 12 guards all at once. It was very difficult. It did take me a few tries. Uh, but after you kill them all, you will get the uh, final document, which you can bring back to Captain Brant and finish the quest. 